I'd like to take a few moments and talk about melodic motion etude number four. This features a line that moves through a key. Again, we're in the key of one sharp, and I'm going to go through what the bass is doing and some of the elements of the melodic line here for you. If you haven't yet done so, I would greatly appreciate it if you would subscribe. Please like, share, and leave a comment. If you'd like to make a donation to the page, my PayPal information is in the description below. And let's get started here with Melodic Motion Etude number four. Now the fingerings I used on the initial post way back when, I believe it was July of 2022, were quite involved quite a reach at times. So I'm going to refinger some of those and still get the melodic ideas out along with the bass motion. So the idea, it's it almost sounds like a 5-1 in every case. So this sounds like G. Here we are at 14 and 15, B and G, strings 5 and 1. And we're coming below to the next melodic neighbor tone in this scale, in the key of one sharp. And then we're going to have a suspension. B and G, F sharp. Now C, that's a, a 4-3 suspension right there with two voices. So it becomes C. And this is 15, 14, and 12. C and F sharp, C and E. So some of these, rather than this longer reach that I used originally, I'm going to take you in to the fifth and second strings. So this would be A and F sharp, 12 and 14, fifth and first strings, with an E below. We hold the E and get this kind of E to D, B in the bass. This is 14 and 15. Now, so we're dropping down to G and E, 10 and 12, with 10 below, melodic neighbor. So G and E to D, and now A and D with this melodic C here on the 13th fret. So 12 and 10 with 13. Now this one may be reachable on the fifth and first strings. So here's F sharp and D with a C. 9 and 10, going down to 8, and that's a 4-3 suspension for G. Sounds like D7 to G. So these are the lines in reverse. have. The bass has to go up. So you could bar. Maybe that's one answer. So here's 7 and 8, E and C, with a B below. Then holding on to the B with the F, sorry, with a C with the F sharp and releasing it to the B. B to A. 7 and 8, 7, 9 and 7, F sharp and B, down to A. Same kind of pattern. 
So our melody is coming down and our bass is coming up by a step. So D and B. Five and seven going down to five. And now E and A dropping down to G. Seven and five down to eight on the second string. And you might just want to take just a few notes of this pattern and try to work out variations that you, of your own that you like. Then what did we get, get? Maybe this one's approachable the long way. So here's C and A, three and five, down to three, and our little sus four, C and A down to G, D and G, that's sus four, and releasing to three, four, three, melodically. And we're gonna resolve to this 10th, B and G. Another way to come. Guess we could leap up and do the suspensions that way. This is how other studies can be developed. Just following a line. So I hope this can give you some ideas. I'll put a link to Melodic Motion A2 number four down below. See if you can get some of it in your fingers. Certainly good for the ears, good for the eyes. If you can make these stretches, It's a nice way to move the hand, but maybe the inside ones will be a little simpler to follow. I hope this finds you well, enjoying your music, and I wish you a very good day.